Hey yo, what's going on everybody? It's Tylerius, aka Ty Killington. Yeah, man. All right, in this video, we're talking about the brand new battle rifle that was added with the Chop Shop DLC to GTA Online. And with this testing, we'll be looking at the range, the damage, the rate of fire, the time to kill, and we're going to be comparing it to a few other guns uh, the Assault Rifle Mark II, which I think it's closely related to, and then it's the Standard Carbine, which is, you know, one of the oldest guns in the game, and to see how it holds up against that. And we'll be talking about whether or not this weapon is even worth it and where it fits in the meta with all of the other guns. As of right now, you can only purchase the Battle Rifle from the Gun Van, so you have to find the gun van wherever it goes each day. Uh, for me, with my discount, it's at $383,075. And because it is a battle rifle, I predicted this and talked about this in an earlier video. It is a older weapon, so it does not have access to Mark II ammo or even a lot of attachments. Really just a extended magazine, which goes from 20 to 30 rounds. A suppressor and some weapon tints, some different kinds of uh, color schemes. That's really about it. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of the stats for the battle rifle. The lock-on range is 200 feet or 60 meters, which is pretty standard. The max range of the battle rifle is 370 feet or 112 meters. Uh, the battle rifle rate of fire is 380 rounds per minute. The assault rifle Mark II rate of fire is 360 rounds per minute. And then the carbine rifle rate of fire is 500 rounds per minute. So a typical engagement is roughly around 70 feet or 20 meters in the game. And the battle rifle will unalive another player in 11 rounds at 70 feet or 20 meters. And that gives this particular weapon a TTK or time to kill of 1.57 seconds. Compare that to the assault rifle Mark II. These are all standard ammunition as well. Uh, 11 rounds at 70 feet or 20 meters. And that will give you a TTK of 1.66 seconds all right and then we compare that to the carbine rifle this is not the mark ii variant just a standard variant uh it takes 13 rounds at 70 feet which this will give you a ttk of 1.44 seconds so the battle rifle is in the middle towards the back of the pack uh, in regard to the meta not the best not the worst but when you compare it to the assault rifle mark ii with range the max range the Assault Rifle Mark II will unalive a, a competitor in 18 rounds for a TTK of 2.83 seconds. However, the Battle Rifle at max range, it takes 40 rounds to unalive uh, it's your, your, your op, uh, which would give it a TTK of 6.15 seconds. That's how much difference the Mark II uh, upgrade will have against a standard uh, weapon. And this is just regular ammunition as well. Uh, much like the other weapons with regular ammo, three rounds for a bulletproof helmet. Uh, now, where the battle rifle shines is going to be its recoil. It's got pretty decent recoil. From left to right, we have the battle rifle. Then we have the assault rifle Mark II. Then the carbine. And on the far right, the fourth pattern, that's the battle rifle with two magazines dumped into that spot. So it has very good vertical recoil. It doesn't spread out too much. Uh, it's pretty good. So it does feel like an easier weapon to control, plus the slower rate of fire will help you kind of maneuver the weapon as well. Uh, and then roughly 28 rounds to catch a vehicle on fire. Um, the better rifle, is it worth it? I mean, yes and no. Uh, I, I had to lean towards, you know, kind of like on the no side because you'll get the weapon but you'll barely use it unless you just force yourself to because there are so many other weapons that are as good, if not better, with standard variants or Mark II variants. And when you add in the different types of ammo, the bulletproof or the armor piercing, it's just a whole other ball game. So it's really just a collector's weapon for nostalgia based off the FN foul profile or the platform. So, I mean, again, worth it. Not really just a collector's piece, but I hope this video helped out. Let me know what you think about the new battle rifle in the comments down below. Do you have it? Do you like it? Let me know what your thoughts are. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel for the ills and reals content in the game. Smash, I mean, smash that like button. See you guys in the next one, all right? Peace out. Yeah.